hello everyone uh, welcome to preparing to tutorials and today ke we came up with a new topic uh, that is related to our yellow bell certification and we came up with the concept of six sigma so guys uh, please do share subscribe the channel also click on bell icon so that you guys can get the notification and also please uh, watch out the playlist wherein you guys can find the videos related to uh, yellow bell certification excel quality team lead quality role uh, and the uh, team lead related the interview tutorials wherein we gave him we given the uh, small small information which will help you out in the interviews so keep watching keep learning guys let's move to our today's topic uh, that is six sigma so in this particular video we will uh, look after the six sigma concept so from where we got this concept and what is the benefit of, of this Six Sigma and uh, what kind of efforts we can keep so that we can uh, get a good result in our process. We will also check out all the uh, key concept of the Six Sigma and etc. in this particular video. So guys do remember uh, you may get a questions from the interview around Six Sigma also. If you know at least basic about, about the Six Sigma, yes you will be able to give the answer. So let's move to the introduction part of the Six Sigma. So guys, uh, basically Six Sigma, which is used to reduce, uh, which basically used to uh, reduce or remove the waste and which will improve the effic uh, efficiency in the process. And also it will help us in the customer satisfaction, which is also known as CSET. So guys, uh, Six Sigma basically had an idea. The idea actually is uh, if you can uh, measure how many defects are there in your process and systematically you can figure out that how we can eliminate them post doing all this stuff and uh, if we are finding that yes our uh, defects are almost near to zero which means uh, yes this you have done the six sigma here and this is the basic idea about it so basically six sigma tells that uh, if we are removing if the failure rate is 3.4 part of the million or else uh, which is 99.999 percent perfect which means our process is perfect if we are removing 3.4 part per million errors from our process so guys don't go with this percentage just to remind remind remember that six sigma will provide you 99.9997 percentage of the perfect uh, evolution so guys do remember six sigma basically uh, worked on data driven method uh, wherein he required the exact amount of data he exact uh, calculation of the data so that it can analyze the things very easily okay and six sigma basically remove the waste and inefficacy in our process and it will also increase the customer satisfaction it basically also help us in focusing on the perfect product and the service and it also help us in removing the uh, defects removing uh, reducing the cost increasing the profit and improving the process so these are all are the introduction about the six sigma if interviewer is going to ask you this question i hope you guys can able to give the answer to the next uh, part so we have the key concept of six sigma basically there are total five key concept of six sigma the first one is critical to quality basically this is very much important to the customer here in this particular part we will understand how a particular concern and the resolution is critical to the uh, customer and important to the customer and uh, this is basically known as critical to the quality defect which need to be removed uh, as soon as we can and uh, to make us make our process uh, error free and we can also improve the scores in terms of it process capability what your process can be delivered which this is the main concept of the six sigma variation what the customer uh, see and feel this also we need to take care and this is also a part of six sigma stable operation ensuring that the process will be improved and customer uh, what the customer says and what the customer feels so these are all the key concept of six sigma just remind the name and the simple definition whenever interview interviewer going to ask you this particular question 
moving to the next here we can see the benefit and where from where the six sigma got originated so basically first we will see like from where we got this six sigma concept is it's basically we got it from the motorola company in 1980s uh, wherein uh, there was a production failure and uh, a scientist basically started uh, working on it and they have basically given a good improvement in the motorola company what are the benefit of six sigma basically uh, we, we we will have a error free process we will reduce the uh, defects we will increase the customer satisfaction with the help of this we will also improve the rate of improvement we will also uh, execute the strategic changes if we require anything to be done and it basically sustain the success for the long time so this is about the introduction on the six sigma just to remember introduction the key concept the benefit and from where it got originated if you give this answer in front of manager or interviewer definitely you will clear your round so basically i hope you guys have learned a uh, very very much today with regards to the six sigma tomorrow we will come up with some more videos related to the six sigma so that you guys can clear your concept and you can give your interview very neatly uh, so guys also check my uh, uh, Facebook page, Instagram page uh, wherein I will be posting vacancies related to the team lead quality and the associate role. Please do cross check and uh, just let us know on which particular topic you require the video and don't forget to share and subscribe the channel. Also share your views in order to you have any error, confusion or anything you require help from my side. Thank you so much guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.